this falls over, this unit has a auto shut off if there's low oxygen. So if it's in a, in a small room and it's not getting enough fresh air, this thing will shut off. It also has a tipping shut off mechanism. So if this falls over, it shuts off and it won't start a fire. Those are some really nice features to have. The way this unit works is it will take two of these little one pound propane tanks, or you can buy a hose kit, which I did and you can hook it up to a larger tank, like a 20 pound tank. These little canisters fit in on the sides and this one will take two. So on both sides here, you can stick a propane tank. With one tank, you can operate this on the low and medium setting, but if you wanna go on the high setting, you need to have two tanks. This pivots, which is kinda nice. You don't have to sort of sloop it in underneath. You just turn it on, slide it down, and then it's got a nice little compartment. Super, super easy. Low setting is 4,000 BTUs. The medium setting is 9,000 BTUs. And the high setting is 18,000 BTUs. It says it'll heat up to 400 square feet, like a room, 400 square foot room. They do say they're safe for indoors, but you got to have fresh air coming in. I'm super nervous about ever operating anything with gas inside a house, but this is probably better for, you know, your tent, your ice shack, maybe your garage, but just make sure you've got fresh air coming in so that you don't die from carbon monoxide poisoning. Basically, there's a little sparker right down here on the front. You just push it down, you hear that gas, and now the flame is going. These things put out a lot of heat. Like you can really feel it coming off. And then to turn it off, you just go to the off position. The blower shoots air up right here over the unit. So you could have it kind of far away from you. Let's say you're sitting outside. The fan will just blow nice warm air on you. Super handy to have, you know, for camping, sitting outside, prepping dinner or whatever you want to do. There's a switch on the top up here that is for your fan. You just turn that on and off. That's if you have batteries in it. And then on the back, the batteries go in the back compartment here. And that takes four D batteries. There's also mounting bolts on the back here. So you can hang this on a wall if you wanted right here. So you could hang it up on your wall in your ice shed or something like that. As long as you've got fuel, you've got heat. And I would highly recommend getting this hose just so you can run on larger bottles. It's just so much better. You're not carrying around all these little guys. <laughs>